Hey, Sagittarius. So, I'm getting a feeling you could be contemplating something or someone else. They could be feeling like, did I do the right thing? Is this the way I should have done this? Or could I have done something differently? Um, now, someone someone could have passed. This could have been recent. This could have been a very long time ago. There could be some type of guilt about something. You could be holding these thoughts or someone around you. But you did pull. I have, I bring you a message from your deceased loved one. I am happy at peace. I love you very much. Please don't worry about me. So, you know, that may not apply to everyone, but there's some type of self-forgiveness about something. Now, some of you, um, Spirit is saying you need to release resentment about some type of money. Um, focus on your priorities. Now, you could have freed yourself from something, someone. And always keep in mind the energies can be vice versa. Um, could have been a husband. Someone could have been in jail. Maybe they're being freed or something like that. Um, so, you need to focus on some type of priority. I'm getting a... Oh, wow. Okay. Something about teenage years. Possibly, you know, teenage years being lost. So, you know, I don't know why I'm getting that. Um, are you dealing with a Virgo? Some of you, this could be talking about a Virgo. It, you know, it doesn't have to be. It can be anyone. Like a male, um, a child, or I don't know. Okay. Virgo. So there could be someone that's very judgmental. Someone could be very handsome, beautiful, just like glowing. Their skin. You could be dealing with a Leo, a Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. It can be any sign, of course. Um, someone can be embarrassed about something that happened between you and them. You could have been dealing with someone. <sighs> so maybe someone revealed their true colors to you. Um, I do feel like there's someone that misses you. They could possibly want to talk to you, call you, something like that. Um, so you need to let go of some type of guilt if this is you now. Um, Focus on your priorities. Focus on the things that mean the most to you. Um, clearing some type of debt, some type of energy detoxing. Detoxing can be, you know, negative energies, negative people, friends, family, lovers, whoever. Um, see, I keep trying to call you Virgo, um, which I just did a Virgo read, but... So there could be a neighborhood, you could be a community of some sort, um, a family situation I could be talking about. <sighs> Sagittarius. So there does look like a separation. You could have parted ways with someone or vice versa. Maybe this person just brought you down. Okay, Sagittarius, Sagittarius. I feel like you've gotten some clarity on a lot of things. You've gotten answers on a lot of things. Um, so there, there could be someone who tries to, whoever you're dealing with, you could be dealing with a Gemini also. You could be like, you both are very dominant and you, you struggle with power, power play. Um, okay, Sagittarius. Mm. Wow. There could have been a loss of money, a loss of friendship, just rejection. 
like I say, you you're, you're don't want something. You don't want someone. Someone could feel rejected from you, but either you or the other person feels great, though. Like, this could have this was like the best thing that, that happened. Um, pick your side now. So someone feels absolutely freaking wonderful, like seriously celebrating. Now I will say this also. See, I think you're over something. Um, someone could have been shocked by your decision. I don't think you want to renew anything with whoever this is. Now, there could be a sense of feeling like Spirit was saying in that mindset of not having enough money. So, you could have more money going out than coming in. There could be some type of resentment about money. Just not very satisfied with something. Um, now, if, if you rejected someone or severed ties with someone, I feel like this person's just like in shock. They, they just can't believe it. Um, now I'm trying to call you Capricorn. Um, Sagittarius. Oh, goodness gracious. Ten of Swords. Okay, now. Someone could have passed. I mean, does it have to be? But the death card with the Ten of Swords, I mean, that could honestly be a death. So there could be some type of guilt, or it just could have been like a very harsh ending. Um, could have been betrayed over and over. So someone could feel trapped and stuck in their head. Hmm. I'm going to get more. I'm just trying to get the feel. All right, Sagittarius. Sagittarius. Could be overly burdened with something or just feeling worried about what other people might think about you or them. Um, all right, Sagittarius. Sagittarius. So, something could be taking a very long time. Um... You could be waiting. I'm telling you, now you or the other person, someone wants to communicate. You may get a phone call from someone out of nowhere. Could be a fire sign, a Libra. Um, can be anyone. You may have someone around you who just comes and goes as they please. Um, they could be from out of town, distance. Doesn't have to be. See, I keep picking up a heavy Virgo also, but somebody wants to communicate. Now, this could be something dealing with a child. I feel like some fire, someone could have been playing with fire or a fire of some sort. Um, Sagittarius. So you have the two of cups. Now, there could be a distant relationship, but there could be someone who wants your attention. They could want to, I'm telling you, there's someone, it can be a friendship, family member, distant relative, I don't know. Someone wants to communicate with you. Um, maybe someone's not getting the attention that you used to give them. Cancer, Pisces, Taurus, I'm getting. Um, see, I'm getting, now it could be parents, a father. So there's some clarity that's, that's, so someone has gotten clarity on a situation. Clarity. Now there could be gossip, some type of news, spreading rumors, slander, um, so, it's like you made your bed, now you get to lay in it, is what I'm getting. Um, could have been some type of, like, verbal abuse, psychological, um, just... Someone could feel like someone verbally attacked them. 
Okay, I keep wanting to call you Capricorn. Um, Sagittarius. Ooh, so you have a fire sign. Okay. <laughs> so what I'm getting is you could possibly want to talk to this person or someone wants to talk to you. But someone's like, they maybe someone can't own up to something. They can't face you. It could be that. Maybe you want clarity. You want some answers from someone. This could be about money alone. Um, doesn't have to be, though. But there could be someone who wants to come back. But maybe you want truth. You want clarity. You want answers. I feel like there's lack of trust. Heavy Leo, Capricorn, Pisces. Like I said, um... I'm telling you, I get a sense of someone could be embarrassed about something and they can't face you. Someone could be embarrassed about a decision that they made, something that happened already in the past. I do feel like either you have someone missing you or you miss someone. Um, you could have someone heavily watching, spying. This could be a sibling you may be blocking this person. I, I feel like someone does not even want to talk to someone. So someone could be very codependent on someone. Um, listen, this is what I'm getting. Someone is not happy, but someone's very happy. So pick a side. So if you have severed ties with someone and rejected someone, I feel like you're the one who's just freaking living life. Like you feel better. You've rid yourself of these skin tags, you know, these negative people. Um, so that's what I'm saying. I'm picking up some type of heavy gossip. Um, okay, Sagittarius. So complacency, someone just sitting, um, dwelling on something. Could be some type of depression. Could be something to do with money. Um, you know, maybe someone has lost their passion for something, passion in life, or just the drive to do something. Yeah. So it could be about work, a job. Someone's just possibly trying to just not happy where they are in life I'm feeling so you could be just kind of down and out we all get like that you know could I have done something different in life you could just be pondering over past events or just your life in general um you know should I have done this I could have done this maybe I should have went to school I, I don't know you, you know it can be anything See, I'm getting a sense of guilt. If this is not you feeling guilty, there's someone around you who feels guilty. Um, okay. Sagittarius. So you need to trust your inner guidance, your intuition. Someone may want to make amends with you, I'm telling you. Um, all right, Sagittarius. See, I just get a sense of someone. Someone, so you could feel like you missed out on some type of opportunity or someone around you feels like that. There's a lot of guilt. Like something happened. Could I have stopped this? Could I have prevented this from happening? You know? Could I have done something differently? I don't know. Hmm. Sagittarius. So you could be dealing with a water sign, a Virgo, an air sign. So may, see, I'm just feeling like you severed ties with someone. 
there was just a harsh ending, possibly. Could be a Gemini as well, a Capricorn, a Pisces. Um, so this could, see, I was picking up a Virgo. Something could have happened to a Virgo. Now that is not for everyone, but like a male, a child, maybe young, like 30 or below the age. Now that is definitely not for everyone, but Hmm. Um, Sagittarius. I keep wanting to say Virgo. Sagittarius. So, someone's birthday. Is it Sagittarius? Happy birthday, Sagittarius. I, I Listen, I'm not a big birthday person, so I forget what, you know, season we're in. So, all right. So, there's a lot of disappointment in something. Sagittarius. judgment. I, I'm just getting, I heard like the way something went down. Could be a father figure as well. So something could just be n not fixable. But, but I feel like something is repairable. Um, Sagittarius. But see, maybe you're deciding to move forward. You don't want this anymore. You could have been just left disappointed in severed ties, like I said. But I'm telling you, there's someone they want to communicate with you. They could be watching, spying. I'm, I feel like you're going to get a phone call from whoever this is. They could want to apologize. Um, sad. Sagittarius. But see, I feel like you're dealing with someone who, there's, there's a lot of people here. I feel like you're dealing with someone who, uh, now you could feel like this or them. They've never really been in a position to where they've, so someone could have never experienced these things so they don't understand could be they don't relate um someone could feel like they were under attack um a disaster i don't just take my words and go with it if it doesn't apply then you know um sagittarius fire sign as well. Um, but see, I'm, I'm still picking up a heavy Virgo for you. Now, you could have someone, look, there is one male, a lot of females now. This could be something completely different. Um, so there could be like a ceremony going on or that's going, being planned. Um, you could be looking at photos from the past, like reminiscing about people, places, things, whatever. Um, heavy Gemini as well. A Taurus. So, someone could just be very immature. They just don't relate um, at all. But you could have someone who wants to apologize, make amends. Um, you know what I just heard? If you did sever ties with someone, it's like this person's having an outer body experience. Like, they're really going through it. They're going through something. Um, it's like this person is codependent on you, your energy. So, something like that. Um, all right, one more. Um, and then I am done. All right, Sag. So, what is some advice for you? What is some advice for Sagittarius? What is some advice? Ooh. So connect to the cosmos. Um, so look beyond. Stargaze. Maybe study some astrology. Take some time to be still and pray. Pray to God. Um, 
but connect with the universe. I feel a sense of being still, um, meditation. You know, oh, you know what? When you're alone at night or just when it's, you get quiet time, you could sit still and that, I feel like that's when you do reflect on things. Should I have done this? Could I have done this differently? Or is something like that. Celebrate life. I mean, disappointment is not the end. So I do see a sense of, of a disappointment, but it's not the end. Um, so anyway, Sag, that is what I have for you. See you in the next one.